Hello, 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 hello. This is Larissa, and I am here to set up my monthly view in my Erin Condren Horizontal Life Planner. And I decided to go ahead and use another printable kit from Tralala on Etsy Shop. And I was sort of not going to do that. I had really wanted to use my own stickers and washi tapes to create a really nice layout. But for some weird reason, I was stressing about it. <laughs> and I'm like, this is too much energy. And I just couldn't think of of, of a, a layout that I wanted to create it that I felt would look good in my monthly spread. And so I'm just going to go ahead and give in to using a kit. Nothing wrong with using a kit. I just really have a lot of supplies on hand that I would like to utilize to create something really nice and use my own creative thoughts. But I said, Larissa, just go ahead and do a kit. A kit is beautiful. It helps me to learn the layout of this particular planner because it's newer to me. And um, the practice rounds that I did, I didn't really like those. And those were with my own stickers. So <laughs> I'm having a little chit chat with you right now. So I don't know if anyone else is having this issue, but to me, it's the same thing as not wanting to write in something new just yet because it's brand new and you just want to look at it, right? But I'm not doing that this year. I'm using all of my stuff, all of my stuff. So for now, just to get the ball rolling, I'm going to use a printable kit. And I think it's a really pretty kit. And it, again, it will give me um, the opportunity to really learn my planner a little bit better. I feel like the pressure is on right now because it is now January. <laughs> and so... Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and use the kit. So if you would like to see what I do with this kit in my horizontal Erin Condren life planner for the monthly view, stay tuned. So here is the monthly view for my Erin Condren Horizontal Life Planner. And I'm excited to go ahead and decorate this planner so that I can go ahead and fill in um, the monthly things that I have for January. <laughs> so again, this is the kit that I am using. I have already um, cut my sticker paper. And I am ready to go ahead and dive in. I did not use um, any machine to pre-cut this. And sometimes I just enjoy doing that. Um, it's a part of me just working with my hands. So, um, so I have already pre-cut a lot of these. Well, I did. And... I sort of scaled it down just a little bit to make for sure that it would fit on my pages. So I'm not going to use any washi tape. I'm just going to use the stickers itself. And I like the top portion. I decided not to use the date covers as well. Um, I just felt like that would be too much pressure to try to line that up and I didn't want to take a risk and I actually like the dates just how they are. So I have no problem with that. So let's go ahead. I'm going to work on the left hand side of this calendar first. So I hope you guys' um, New Year's is off to a wonderful start. And that you had fun bringing in the new year. I did. I enjoyed myself. Okay. Great. 
great. I like it. Off to a good start. Let me go ahead and put the other header on this side. Uh, I'm going to move that over just a little bit. That's good. I'm happy with that. And now I'm going to go ahead and put on my sidebar here. I actually just finished watching the Hallmark Channel. And they're still doing a Christmas theme movies of course <laughs> and so I have these holiday songs in my head but I'm not going to sing them <laughs> okay I like that that's cute I like that all right let's go ahead and do the next one here Forgot what I wanted. I love this with her stiletto boots, <laughs> knee high stiletto boots. That is so cute. So I think I might put that there. Let me open this back up so I can see everything. And I know I want to put a sticker here. So. Do I want to do this one? Okay, yeah, I think I'll just do it like this. That's a holiday, and I don't want to cover up the holiday information, so um, I might cut the sticker down and still use it. I'm not for sure what I'm going to do just yet. Okay. I like that. 
And then telling kits make things a lot easier, don't they? <laughs> uh, let's see here. I do need to note something special for this day. So maybe I'll put this one right here. I'm going to cut it down just a little bit so it's not hanging over the edge. This way I could still leave the date. Or do I want to go ahead and just cover the date? It's not like I wouldn't know what day it is, right? Uh, so let me do that. So those of you who put up a, a Christmas tree, have you already taken it down yet? Or do you like to leave yours up a little bit longer after the holidays? I love Christmas lights. So if I could leave my Christmas tree up all year. I really would. I will leave all decorations up. I, I love it. It's so, it just warms me up, you know? So, <laughs> okay. And I think I'll put one here because I'm gonna take it easy this Saturday. Voila. Okay. And I think that's really all I wanted to use. I have this one, but I really don't want to use it. So probably after I go in and fill out my monthly activities, birthdays and any anniversaries I will come back here and add some more stickers because this I need more stickers but this gives me a good jump start like I said I know this day I have not made any plans not visiting anyone <laughs> not hosting anyone and then um, I know on the 5th, I have a special um, thing to do. So I wanted to mark that. I can go ahead and get that out of the way. And I cover the dates that are not actually a part of the month of January. And then I put this one down on the holiday just because it's pretty and I'm off that day. So just want to put it there. Um, I do have activities for that day, but yeah so that's all i have for this month's layout and let me know what you think let me know if you have a new planner system that you're trying to get used to and get over the hump and concerns about um, your layout not being perfect uh, <laughs> This is my way of getting over that hump because I was like, I don't know what I want to do. And I have so many beautiful stickers to use. So many beautiful washing to use. It's just, I'm sort of mad at myself. But this is um, my effort to get over that hump and keep it moving because I have 12 more or I should say 11 more months to decorate. So it's fine. <laughs> and the stickers that I don't use this year, if I decide not to give them away and God blesses me to see 2021, I'll be good to go then. So thank you so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed this video and that there was something you could relate to or something that will help um, get you over your new planner hump um, <laughs> and keep the ball moving. Um, 
Thank you so much for joining me. As always, I ask that you like this video, subscribe and turn on your notification buttons. And thank you so much for joining me. And once again, Happy New Year. May God bless you abundantly this year. May you see the hand of God over your life and that you will continue to grow and prosper and enjoy life. Talk to you soon. Bye.